The nine more RCMP say arson is to blame for two separate fires at the Harmac landfill. Investigators say over the past two weeks, someone stacked piles of old stumps and wood debris and set them on fire. While firefighters were there to extinguish the fires before they spread, crews worry next time they may not be so lucky. A News reporter Cheryl Bloxham has more. Smoke fills the air near the Harmac pulp mill. Several fires break out, sending fire crews into action. They attack on foot and with heavy machinery. Firefighters were called to the scene around noon after reports piles of old wood were burning. There was a uh, three pile set fire at the um, Harmac mill in the dump area. Um, the crews responded um, with the Harmac crew to extinguish the fire. This is the second time in less than two weeks fire has sparked in the same area. The first was reported on June 10th at about 8.30 p.m. In that particular case, a wood pile was set on fire at the landfill. Fire crews are on scene. They put it out within about two hours. Firefighters spent more than six hours battling Wednesday's fire and making sure it didn't reignite. Investigators have been combing the scene, and police say the two separate fires in the same area are no coincidence. Uh, it's a restricted area. No cars can get in there, so somebody did it on foot or a motorcycle. I mean, the first one last Friday, that's one thing, and then three more uh, yesterday. You never want to see that because if uh, these fires take off, you've got a forest on the other side, the winds go the wrong way, and uh, you could have a problem on your hands. Harmac says it's now doing regular patrols of the area and will be moving the old wood to make it less tempting for arsonists. We saw three trucks on the way into this site and we just want to make sure that, you know, if there's somebody still lurking around that they're not going to have the opportunity to start anymore before we can clear these out of here. And police want to find the fire bug. Huge concern. Right now the weather's been cooperating with us, but with the dry weather upon us, we want to nip this in the bud before any more fires start. If you know anything about the suspicious fires, contact Nanaimo RCMP or Crime Stoppers. Cheryl Bloxham, A News.